Hi, I'm Jonathan Hampton, filming from my classroom where I teach because that's an important part of my life. It has been for the last 15 years and will remain so as I uh, begin my journey here in the Washington, D.C. area. I grew up in Chicago, taken in and showing off the sounds of soul and R&B while also getting classical choral skills. Having left the South Side at nine to board and sing at the American Boy Choir School in Princeton, New Jersey, I returned home classically trained and having traveled globally. Bigger unit to a smaller unit or from a smaller unit to a bigger unit? A smaller unit to a bigger unit. I would definitely recommend a school, but they have to be prepared to come and leave their parents and to change their life and have to adapt to other things. In high school, I was an assistant for the All City Elementary Youth Chorus, teaching sectionals at age 13. And I later founded my own courses, summers in college and year round and with alumni in New York. Recruited as the director of courses at Grace Church in Newark, New Jersey, I developed a youth program conducting weekly rehearsals, theory lessons, and monthly performances. I simultaneously worked in administration at Carnegie Hall, where over five seasons I coordinated online and live distance learning programs, concerts, and workshops for students, teachers, and artists in India, Mexico, Turkey, Indonesia, and across the country. The song that gives me hope is Precious Lord. It's a spiritual that was uh, favorited by Martin Luther King Jr. It holds a, a very deep meaning surrounding not only the, uh, the, the spiritual aspects of, of God being a helping hand, but also uh, is a representative of the civil rights movement and uh, God's hand in that. Take my hand, precious Lord, and lead me home. When you see that ship come sailing, All of which prepared me for teaching and administration, developing and maintaining the reputation of the Grammy Award winning choir school in Oakland, California, Pacific Boy Choir Academy. helps them become better community members, better young uh, gentlemen in life and with good life skills. And uh, also to be part of um, you know, the mission of, of reaching out to and helping their own community by coming to schools. They sing really well. I thought that the performance was really amazing and I think that all the soulful um, songs were really, really good. This is like one of our CD recordings, Show Me The Way. It's a lot of African American spirituals. I 
hear the carols from them and rolling through the land. Oh, get on board, little children, get on board, little children, get on board, little children. There's room for many a Recently, I've helped improve and publicize education programs for a renowned chamber orchestra and choir, American Box Solos, an up-and-coming youth course, San Francisco Youth Course, an eclectic arts powerhouse for which I created music programs both in and out of schools, East Bay Center for the Performing Arts, and a handful of others along the way. The through line has been my developing and fostering a strong desire to promulgate the arts to as many as will actively partake. I promote arts appreciation and understanding to affect broad benefit and pleasure, just as I enjoy. Hallelujah to that Lamb. 
this moment, I'm most interested in exploring how my openness to new possibilities can affect the arts and how our field can impact the major changes happening in our society and its views. It's an exciting time of change and I embrace the opportunity to reimagine and reinvigorate our field right now. I believe we can discover new directions in education, artistic programming, and performance. We're on the verge of a paradigm shift in multiple ways of thinking and living, so it seems most apropos to willingly delve into our new realm of the unknown toward helping shape a wonderfully enigmatic future. You ain't ever gonna forget this picnic, I reckon. You ain't ever gonna forget this picnic, I reckon. You ain't never ever gonna forget this picnic, I reckon. This I know, cause it's red and so. Sick, sick soul.